Hello guys, it's Mickey. Welcome to my channel. And if you're just tuning to my channel, please subscribe. Turn on the notification bell so as to be notified each time there's an upload coming from me. So today's Sunday, as you guys know now, Mickey's Sunday routine. I try as much as possible to pull out question asked all through the week and I try to give you an honest reply. So let's begin. All right, so we've got a question here from Alfra Daily. I just stumbled on this page and you speak too well. It makes you actually sound very creditable. Keep your poise, darling, and dropping those nuggets. You look awesome. Lord, I think you're a guy. You sound like a guy. <laughs> like you're hitting on someone. <laughs> All right, but um, you might still be a girl. But thanks for the compliment. Anyways, thank you. Um, we've got another question here from Winnie JP. Mickey, I love your work. You always look good. I'm a fair lady but have a very dry and sensitive skin i've used all some creams i think typographical error but it doesn't work for me please which cream do you think i should well we don't recommend creams here we only talk about we just give tips right talk about um, creams i give reviews and all that but recommending a product for you no and again if you actually have sensitive skin you should you should not say creams don't work for you most times most of you you know you confuse having easily having skin irritation just because you have skin irritation on time doesn't mean you have sensitive skin some of you confuse it it's like a, a customer of mine that used to have a skin irritation quickly sometimes if she uses cream she starts having like a, some like ratchets or pimples at the back of her buttocks and then she says, i have sensitive skin it doesn't work that way that's not how to know because if you have a sensitive skin creams should react even if you change creams like like every day creams will still react on your skin all right so don't say you have a sensitive skin you might not actually have a sensitive skin not that you might you don't because for you to say cream does not work on you you don't have a sensitive skin all right we have a question here from zarina gal mickey which age is the best to start using anti-aging creams and supplements anti-aging or anti-aging well um <clears throat> that question is relative the reason why it's relative is because one when it comes to aging, people age differently. They do. There are people that they are in their fifties. They don't use any topical creams. They don't. They, they just eat normal good food and all that, and they don't look their age. And there are people that if they are in their thirties, they start looking like they're in their fifties. Some people still say it's how you take care of your, yourself is how you do. And there are some people that you know they smoke. Their lifestyle also depicts how they age. So there's no particular age, but naturally people say for a lady, once you're already storming, like in your 29, 30, you should start using some supplements as well as uh, not necessarily anti-aging products for now. But if you get to 28, 29, from that age, you start taking supplements. And also for a lady, if you start noticing like uh, age spots and um, fine lines, you should start using uh, anti-aging products okay but in terms of supplements the age of 20 even most people still say 27 but 28 29 you should start taking supplements so it helps in the long run all right now we've got a question here from zarina gal also mickey can jeggings be used as a maintenance cream it can it's it's, it's just a normal it's a cream used in glowing the skin most people will say jeggings i've used jeggings for so long it doesn't glow the skin only jeggings alone, you know, you might probably need to add some things into it. But it does glue the skin. And it can also be used in maintaining the skin because it doesn't alter the skin. But I hope you know you are using U.S. jeggings, not Nigerian jeggings. Nigerian jeggings will darken you. Okay. So, um, a question here from Oni Becky. Thanks, dear. Which, where can I get it in Cameroon? Please help me. I don't know. Because right now, it's not even in Nigeria. They've closed the border. I don't know where you can get it in Cameroon, but check it out. You can find it. Um, I don't know how to pronounce this name. I'll just call it Cynthia anyway. Auntie Mickey, please help me with remedy for red sunburn. Um, you actually want sunburn. We actually do the mixing for you. So you can actually contact me 0818-541-7558 to mix that product for you. Same thing with that lady that says she has anti-aging. Uh, she has a sensitive skin. That products don't work on her. You can actually contact me. I can actually give you my cream because I do have a sensitive skin. So if my cream doesn't work on your skin, honey, you don't have a sensitive skin. All right. 
So we got a question here from Yamabondi. Where can I get this product? Please, I do sell it on my website. So you can check Mickey Skincare or NG. The website will be, dis the, um, will be displayed on the top of my YouTube video right now. Uh, we've got a question here from um, Shekinat Sumbo. You are just too good. Am I? You know, most times when people say I'm just too good, I find it... Uh, I'm not going to say I don't like compliments. Everyone does like compliments. But um, I don't really like it when, um, you know, people say I'm just too good. I'm just too good. I'm like, am I really good? You know? I'm just there. I'm just okay. Because I feel if I'm really good, I shouldn't be going for more training and more training. But uh, well, thank you very much. Thank you. All right. We've got a question here from Theresa Michael. Yay, 20k subscribers. Doing yeah, keep doing you, baby. Yes, so I even see I'm too. Thank you very much, there is a mic. I saw it to 20k subs. I was like, what? Yes, so but thank you, my YouTubers. I love you guys like Kilo Day. It's been you guys all along. It's been you guys. You know, keep you keep watching, even though some of you say, ah, this thing they chop my data, but Mickey, it's you we'll do it for you because we learn, you know. I'm really happy because I know how much you guys spend on that alone. Just watching. Sometimes I might even have videos of 51 minutes and you guys are still watching. You still comment. Thank you very, very much. All right, we've got a question here from Cindy Away. Thank you so much for this. Please tell us how to remove chicken pox dots from the body. I had chicken pox two years ago. Please, what can I use to clear them off my body? I am melanin poppy, not fair skin. Um, most times things that actually take off anything like body spots and the rest there's a cream used for taking off body spots but at the same time um you need to exfoliate and like right you need to scrub because most times those scrubbing you're taking off the dead skin cells so you're opening it and allowing the cream to work so if you actually want to take off those things because i think in school then i had a friend that had chicken pox she was always coming to my room she wanted me to have it too but it never happened <laughs> always sleep on my lap you know intentionally coming to my room you know, she said it Mickey, monica i wanted you to have chicken pox <laughs> like but it never happened <laughs> all right so um there are creams you use for dark spots naturally but you need to scrub more often okay you don't go for all this whitening chemical scrub no you can use yoko because yoko contains more of uh, granules but you can still use sugar scrub because you know salt scrub tends to dry the skin so if you actually have a dry skin i wouldn't advise to use salt scrub can actually go for sugar scroll okay all right so um we've got a question from zainab alubarika god bless you jerry amen um damistacia dubi 20 k so yay thank you honey christine osang hey mickey i love your videos please how can i order your ebook you just chat me up zero eight one eight five four one seven five five i've not even added it in my um website you know when that order one my Web designer was misbehaving and the other one closed up. This one, in order to put product safe, is I'm just, you know, a bit just held back. But I would start putting products and all that. All right, please don't be offended. All right, we've got a question from Amaka Onwankwo. What about nature secret oil? Does it lighten? What do you mean by what about nature secret oil? Does it lighten? Nature secret oil contains argan snail oil. So depends on your skin there are some skin that we use it they say it doesn't lighten it there are some skin that use it and say it just helps in glowing their skin so it depends on your skin honey amaka wanko you smile your smile alone is killing <laughs> really <laughs> stop hitting on me amaka wanko all right we've got a question here from abigail Ade, Ade Jola. please make it i really need to get this action jolly glowing oil and some other stuff you mentioned here how can i go about it check on my website it's available on my website Make it skincare.ng, not the .com. The .com is the old one, I beg. Don't go for the .com any longer. I don't use it. Kelechi Wanko, make it skincare. I should continue using it, right? Continue using what? Um, Kelechi Wanko, make it skincare. Thanks, you're welcome. Kelechi Wanko, please, how good is Skin Success Feed Milk by Palmas? Because it contains 2% hydroquinone. Just because it contains 2% hydroquinone doesn't mean it's not good. It's really, really good. It's a nice cream. But cream that contains hydroquinone should not be used in a long period of time. It should be used in a short period of time. Then you switch to something else. All right. Ashley Nicole. 
with the glucosion infinity why is it true that the mg is 50,000 and where can i get the legit ones at with the glucosion frozen i do sell it so you can probably get on my website and um, i don't i think i have the glucosion infinity yes i do so you can find it on my website ashley nicole how long is the expected result when you take lux white you see one thing about this glucosion injection and pills one cannot determine how long because it works differently on the skin we have different skin type it works differently there are some people that like when i was taking my own lux white and um i think i took it with yes with collagen i couldn't take it with vitamin c because i tend to break out when i take vitamin c i was adding up i was adding weight you know and um apart from that i i noticed brightening but i couldn't tell you know i was still using my cream i couldn't tell but i noticed my skin was even even with my normal cream and my i'm still using my cream on my skin and i stopped taking the pills because it's finished i stopped taking the pills and my skin is still the same but i was really adding weight i was i was really adding weight and i was eating just little food but i was adding weight and my skin was looking fresh okay so you can't tell when and when what time when it will the body system works totally different right so um we got a question here from but it's it's really nice those supplements are nice though lux white is quite pricey but it's nice it's really really nice deborah igbiriki mickey skincare hi mickey i've been watching your videos i really want to talk to you please kindly drop a link to your whatsapp 0818541755 if you're out of nigeria it will be plus two three four you put nigerian code 818-541-7558. We got a question here from Essential Beauty Palace. Hi Mickey. Nice work for my maintenance. I use rose water all over my body. Is it a nice idea or I should still get a maintenance cream? Since it's good on you, why change it? There's something I say if Ori, if shea butter is nice on your skin, why alter it? Alright, if whatever is good on you might not be good on the other person. But if it's not I know of a lady that if you see her skin flawless. My skin self cannot stand in her skin. I delay. But funny enough, she, she tells you that she uses cream of 200 naira. You will not believe. Her, cream, her body cream is just 200 naira. Now I think they've changed it to 400 naira cream. That's what she uses. This, uh, what's the name of this? Something clear, something, something. That's what she uses. I tried using that cream. My skin was looking jagger jagger. And that's the only cream she uses. She doesn't add oil. She doesn't. And if you see her skin. So one thing about this skin is different. There are some people that use this cream of 80,000 naira safe. You can't tell. I know of a customer of mine that was using injection, glutathione injection, on a steady basis. She wasn't buying from me though. She was buying from someone else. On a steady basis. And it doesn't look like uh, something that, you know, someone that even used cream safe, he that you love. Your skin was better than our own. And she has been using pills, using injection, using this. Her skin still looks trashy. Trashy. Like confirmed trashy. So the skin works differently, right? There are some people that the, the injection might not, the, the pills, the, I mean, the injection or the pills might not work for, but topical creams will work really well on them, all right? And there are some people that topical creams might not really work, but the injection will do a lot of good, as in we take them to a lot of, you know, <laughs> to, to a better place. That's just it. That's what I'm going to say. Take your skin to a better place. Question here from Princess Peter. You are beautiful, dear. Thank you um question from cookie t please make it don't mind them they are serious people who want to learn about skincare like us you're doing a great job thank you question from annie 0711 please what other cream can you recommend to be used for moisturizing after scraping off those dead layer apart from easy white cream i think i said steroids i already made mention of steroids so there are so many creams that contain steroids you could go with any one of them that contains steroids all right, a question from DJ Mama. Thank you, you're an angel. You're welcome, honey. Cindy, away. Nice one, as always, Mickey. Please, how can I contact you? And you talk about skin types, about skin colors. You mostly talk about lightning, fairness. What about melanin skin color? And because the reason why we really don't talk about melanin skin, we do talk about it. If you go through my video, you see that I've talked about darker skin before. But uh, the reason why we don't lay emphasis on it is because uh, their maintenance is not so pricey. And apart from that, it doesn't take too long to keep their skin shiny and polished.
compared to altering the skin right and i altered my skin so you know, because if you're talking about something people will be like mm-hmm why are you shaking the table? Are you dark skin? So why are you talking about dark skin? That's exactly the point. All right, I've got a question from Toke Olu. You are beautiful there. Thank you. Ashley Nicole, please, if you could answer my question, but I have heard of SM, MSM and wondering if you have as well. MSM cream is not available. I don't think it's in Nigeria. We can order it outside. It's meant to treat a problem, like topical creams meant to treat... Uh, some problems just almost like steroids meant to treat problems skin irritation that's what it treats all right um we've got a question from chileta goodness Mukucha. mickey how do i contact you zero eight one eight five four one seven five five eight we've got a question from our muhammad hello dear please i want you to help me here i'm a dark skinned person and i want to lighten to caramel skin tone but my skin is very very tough i've tried strong lightning products but still no success you have to contact me 0818541755 so we can help you in mixing a particular cream all right a question okay we've got beauty etc here your hair looks awesome on you and the lightning is nice natural lightning is the best i know i be but this one i didn't you just had to put it a bit the sun is so hot so just a bit all right is the best natural lightning is what ring light soft box light and camera light stay to mimic skin popping as usual thank you all right we got a question from grace josia leia it's been a while dear you look sweet all you said is right keep it up thank you tare fashion and beauty um that i needed something that can remove white patches from my legs um if you actually want that you could just chat me up all right, we do sell product that remove white patch from the leg. All right, Atuno Rivera, Mickey, please can you do a review on Easy Glow Strong Glutar C injection? Gold whitening body milk, Mickey, Mickey. Is it gold whitening body Mickey or milk? <laughs> Easy Glow Strong Glutar C. I'll think about it. All right, we got a question from Atuno Rivera. Nice work, Mickey. Keep it up. Mickey, I want to learn. Oh, can I start with the ebook by getting it? Um, once you get the ebook, it's self explanatory, right? But if you actually want me to explain it, just have to. I cannot explain the ebook because I feel the ebook is self explanatory. I used to explain the ebook before, all right? But now I tend to hold online training where we talk, I go explicit about it. But even after going explicit about it, I cannot tell you what to use for a customer. No. It's just like coming to a class you've learned and you are going to write the exam. And I'll not give you a spoof for exam. I can't do that. Right? So, over time, if you listen at it, most times, most people are always in a hurry. Like, there was a woman that went through the online training. She did not let me rest. I want to start production quickly. I want to start production quickly. I want to start, I want to start making money. But you know, yes, you need to make money. It's the basis of it but if you don't take your time and learn that money will just be a waste let me just tell you the truth most of them conju 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 and she the next thing she texted me Mickey, i'm having issues or i was like you can still ask your questions it's the, 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 the place is still open for you to ask but i cannot tell you what to use for customers if you are taking your time to listen you would even know what and what to use but running Always in a hurry, always in a hurry, always in a hurry, always in a hurry. What we were supposed to do for almost two weeks or something, she took like four days to get everything. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Once you are done with the production, now people start complaining. Ah, these things, though, because normally after explaining, I'll still tell you this, no, take this out. There was a lady that was really, really good. She took her time, you know. Okay, Mickey, this, this, okay, yeah, I understand this. But what about, you know, take your time to ask. Even the lady I even sent video um, audio to. Yes, there are some of the audio she didn't even listen to. That's to tell you how it is. Always in a hurry. In country, in country, you want to make money. Have you seen a situation where you make cream for a customer? To Madija, to that you have to mix and use your own money to mix it. <laughs> so, I'm just telling. Most of us are we are always in a hurry. I'm also in this table too. Always in a hurry. All right. So um, we've got a question here from Tabatistry. Your skin is beautiful. I subscribe. Oh, thank you for subscribing, honey. Tawakate, Idris, kisses. 
Mm. I'm blushing. <laughs> okay, we got a question from Agbochinoye. I use this cream alone and it's super good. But my problem is that I hardly see it. Well, it's available. So you can order it on my website. Peace, Samuel. Mickey Skinke. Hi, Mickey. I love your videos. Like Kilo Day. <laughs> Thank you. Obey the joy. Good evening. Please help me. I'm chocolate in color and dry skin too. Please, I need cream. Chat me up. 0818-541-7588. Akotikle. This your scattered reminds me a lot of my mom. And coincidentally, she's called Monica too. So, sis Mickey, you are actually my mom. Mom, uh, no wonder I don't they love you too. Wow. Thanks. I remember someone saying, go and put braces. If you can give me money to put braces, I'll put it. <laughs> and I don't, I don't think it's scattered. After all, it's not. It's just having spaces. You know, when someone said, you have a scattered teeth, it's not scattered. You just had spaces. One thing about we humans is that we want everything in perfection. That's why when we want to be with a guy, you want a perfect guy. Then even in school, we say, I want my guy to be so tall, so handsome. <laughs> If only you know. If only you know. All right. So the, I don't have a problem with my spaces. All right. I do go for dental cleaning, which is nice. Killing and polishing, which is good. So, but saying, um, actually, if you can give me money, Sha, it's 650K. If you can give me money for uh, what they call it, braces, I would gladly do it. All right. But I'm not complaining. And um, people I know are not complaining about, except some people that actually want to say something nasty. But once you look away, you're the one that have the key to make people to. to if you if you allow people to pull you down, then you, it's your problem. But if you 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 are the only person that have the key, all right, to your happiness. Now only you get your key to happiness. No? So if you notice, people say things just to get at you. But once you you shake it off. Mm, they feel intimidated. Ah, get you tears. Get she you tears, Roja. Ah, ah. Could say some cocon. She's not bothered. That's just it. I don't see anything scattered here. I just have spaces. There are people that their teeth is like John Pillow. You know what they call John Pillow? Here. Here. You know, it's like. <laughs> but uh, I don't. I don't count it. I don't. You know, we always want perfection. We want to, there are some girls that, if you see them up to down, perfect. Cha cha, and let's not talk. Abe. <laughs> let's not talk. I feel comfortable in smiling. Then I used to be shy. You no, know, then if I'm talking to someone, I'll be holding my you no. Know? Then I might, mm, 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 because I don't want them to see what is bad in seeing my spaces. I'm not the first person having spaces. Do you know Sam Sultan also has spaces? He has middle teeth. Like, yes. And I'm calling he. Don't mind me. Let's go, Jerry. <laughs> but I could declare, I get you, Jerry. I get you. I understand, honey. Lawa Kemi, this hair really fits you. Thank you. I hope this one fits me too. I've not actually added them um, because this one now needs to go under the water, you know, and also uh, leave-in conditioner to bring out the coils back again. Okay. But I like it like this. It makes my hair look smallish. Okay. So, um, we've got a question from Abbas in Kiru. And bass in Kiruka. Okay. Mickey, the Mickey Mouse. The face towel type tip is working on me. Thanks. Yes, it does. It works. It works. When I noticed as well, you don't see my face, ni? Eh? You don't see my face. No makeup, nothing, nothing. <laughs> we died here. <laughs> it's it's really working. All right. It makes you know you're not going to wash your face. You know, after using your face, your soap to mask your face, then you squeeze you put the face towel. In your water squeeze it and start using it to pat your face that is what you're using to rinse the soap out of your face that way you're giving the soap more effect on your face you notice that even sunburn it will treat sunburn for you if you have a good soap like a goat milk soap it will treat sunburn you don't need to be jumping from this face soap to this face. No, no no it's okay all right you notice that your face is looking nice you're looking really nice Right, since when I don't get breakout for face again, it's a peg on. and it's been a while since I went for facials. Then I used to go for facials like crazy. All right, so now we've got a question from Yamumani. 
Hi, Mickey. You always put a smile on my face. You are so real. Oh, thank you. Okay, we got a question here from... She wrote her name, blah, 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 blah. So that I will not be able to call it blah, 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 blah. So I will not. I'll call the first four letters, which is Sith. All right. So she said, Sith Yebo. Anything I can do to remove dark marks around my eyes. I used the cream and serum combination that was too strong. And now I have unsightly dark circles around my eyes. First of all, do you know how to mix it? Why did you go and do it yourself when you don't know how to do it? All right. You shouldn't have done it yourself. Um, you can actually contact me so we can actually make a cream for you to fade it off. All right, we've got a question, and my contact is 0818-541-7558. we got a question from Rita Fambule. Okay, Mickey, I have a dry skin on my body, and the skin on my face is oily. I need your help. Please, can I use, what can I use on both? Thank you so much. 0818-541-7558. I can actually mix a cream for you. Bless love, Osas. Because I notice each time I tell people I don't recommend, the next thing they tell me, I've noticed their, their guidelines now. You, your manner of approach is just so rude, you know. Then Some of them will not be like, then what do you do? And your skin temperature, then what do you do? You know, after you're not explaining to them, but you sell this product, then you should be able to recommend. You know, there was a lady that was at seat with me on the phone. You know, like, she probably, maybe she wanted to look for trouble. And immediately, trust me, Kina. And me call her phone, me. Just have to switch off the phone. Because she kept, I was like, I don't recommend cream. Then what do you do? And I told her, I mix creams, I sell creams, I sell skincare products. But at the same time, you sell products. Then you should be able to tell someone the product. I said, ah, well, my, if I tell you the product to use, how would I make money? She was like, what's that supposed to mean? Is it not your job? Are you not a skin therapist? Ah, uh -uh. Even if you go to a dermatologist, you will still pay for consultation fee before you see the dermatologist. Is that not how they do in the, in the hospital? If you pay for the uh, consultation fee, you have collected a card. So even if you collect a card and you are going to see, I remember when I when I've not even started this business, when I had crazy spot on my face and I went to see a dermatologist, I paid ten thousand around the spot for consultation. Even after seeing the dermatologist, in contours of way, Kira, something almost eighty something thousand, I still came back another day, saying, okay, I'll come back. I had to look for everything, nothing, 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 honey. Your only choice, so mm. bother show. Even after going back again, okay, you still ask the doctor some questions. It's still limited on some things to tell you. It tells you medical terms that you will never understand. So, honey, what are we seeing here? And some people will now start talking and talking just to get at you. All right, we've got a question here from. Um, well, one thing about it with Afambule is I, I do mix, okay? So you can contact me for me to mix it for you. Um, blessed love, Osas. Good evening, please. Give me your number. My name is Perry Diamond on Facebook. Perry Diamond. 0818-541-7558. Aho Bogre. Oh, I hope I call that word. Or Boger. Or Bogre. I think Boger. I think Berg. I think it should be Berg. <laughs> I think it's a French word or something. All right. I'm Mickey. I have sensitive skin. What whitening soap can I use on my face? And what cream can I? You can actually use my soap. So you can order it from me. My goat milk soap. Mickey's goat milk soap. Yes. I'm yet to put a label. The reason why I'm not putting a label yet is because I'm yet to get a shop. So probably when I get a store, I'll be able to put a label. And my name, my description, the address. But I noticed that in some products, it's not a must to put uh, the address and the rest. You could just put it. You know? I saw the way some skin people are actually doing it now, which is nice. So I want to do that. You don't need to put all those bobo to go name, name, that will make you look local. Right. But most times, even the ingredient they write on it is not the exact ingredient there. So why should we deceive ourselves? So let's continue, please. A question from Vanessa Omeke. My elder sister is dark and she exfoliates like it. this is no one's business. She's been using Yoko Spa since the beginning of time. And she introduced it to me as well. She exfoliated like four times a week. You know, the body system works differently. Vanessa. And apart from that, Yoko is not really a whitening scrub. Mm -mm. We have varieties of Yoko. It depends on the Yoko she's using. You say Yoko Cucumba. Abi? If it's Yoko Cucumba, then she should not expect it for whitening. If she was using the Yoko goat milk, the Yoko milk spot, that one still brightens a bit. But Yoko Cucumba, no. Yoko Cucumba mostly, it's, 
if you add almond oil to it, it helps in glowing the skin. All right, yoko works differently. Like the yoko papaya helps in fading off dark spots on the body. But you need to add something into it to help fade off dark spots. They work differently. They all work differently. Even aloe vera, lemon. Lemon helps in brightening the skin as well. Yoko lemon works in brightening the skin. They all differ. And then um, yoko um, coffee scrub helps for stretch marks. Okay. But if she wants to, uh, this one that you are saying she's using scrub, using scrub, using scrub. Tell her to use chemical based scrub. Yoko is not a chemical, it's a salt. All right. And it dries the skin out because once you use regularly, it dries the skin out. Tell her to use chemical based scrub like extreme scrub, Yoko scrub. Um, I say Yoko Ruti's scrub. And let her see if she will not alter her skin. Let her try it. Let her use extreme. Just extreme. I give her just two weeks. Hmm. Oh, my outer skin, Amy. All right, and the skin works differently, honey. Okay, we've got a question here from Rita Mbala Kawi. Oh, I hope I called that well. Mickey, Mickey, you are looking good, dear. <laughs> Thank you, honey. There's a Michael. Hi, Mickey. Hello. Um, okay, I think that's that's all. That's the old question. We've answered everything today. We have. They are just having, you, see, you know, few questions and all that. You know, this festive period that we are now, people are not really. People don't really purchase things like that, like that festive period. You know. Now, a lady said, I think, yeah, a lady walked, spoke to me and said, um, I always complain a lot. Yes, that I always complain a lot about everything wow when have i complained i probably complain about being a bit tired which every normal human being after overworking yourself you should complain about being tired i don't have an assistant so it's normal for me to complain about being tired right and again she said i complain about and uh, i don't recommend product but after all youtube pays me but I also give back because it's necessary to give back to the community. I give back with tips. I give back with uh, having um, exposure about some particular product reviews. And people have proved it's not that I'm made boasting. My reviews are top notch. I make sure I walk up. There are sometimes I might walk up. There was a lady I walked up to in one of my customer shops just to ask about the product. To buy big girl and she boom me. I received the insult in peace and I left. Probably she doesn't know me, but. You know the way she looked at me. She said, mm -hmm. and I just and my customer was like, ah, you don't know Mickey. She was like, who is Mickey? Who is that? Who is that? And, you know, and I was like, I'm no need. I just let. I wanted the review so I could use it to because I noticed she was buying in bulk, so I could use it to talk about it with my customers. You know, but luckily, the owner of the shop even told me about it. You know, put me through through it. So what I'm just saying is, I spend I take my time in you know. Going out to look for reviews, top-notch reviews, all right, just so you guys can have a basis to hold on to, and you should know that. Okay, hope you know. Probably it might have flaws, and it might not have flaws. It's nice on a particular skin, it might not be nice on this skin. Now you're saying that uh, I complain too much, which is not true. I don't recommend products. Why should I? Because I sell products. I mix products. If I recommend product or I give all the mixtures, how will I survive? And there are some mixtures that I used my I, I used a lot of money in learning. And you people say yes, you after all, YouTube is paying you. Are we not using our subscription? That was what she said. Are we not using our money to subscribe? I'm happy you subscribe. I'm happy you are watching my video. Ah, without you watching it, how will I be paid now? I'm happy you ah, I won't lie. After all. When I even got to 20k, see the way I'm so joyful, I'm happy. I am really, really happy. But try and understand this basis that there are sometimes I've even mixed cream way back. And I noticed I would have even mixed some because there, there was a time I said, okay, so probably this week I might mix. I noticed my recipe are what people, because sometimes I don't even complete it for you. Because my recipe are what people will mix and give it to someone. There was a lady that said, oh, your recipe are not even complete safe. Honey, there's something you should know. 
cream works differently on skin. Some of you have no formal knowledge of that. You mix cream for all skin. And this is a whitening cream. You give it to anybody. And it's a whitening cream to work for you, to work for you, to work for you. It does not work that way. When it's not a base cream. If it's a base cream, it works for all skin because it's a base. It's the foundation of what you want to use in mixing whitening product. But when it's a whitening product, it doesn't work on all skin. There are people with combination skin. We have sensitive skin. We have normal skin. We have dry skin. We have oily skin. Not all skin works the same way. So using the same cream to whiten the old skin, it does not work that way. That's why some of you say the recipe is not complex. It's not complex. Why won't you say it when you don't even know what you are doing? Most of you don't know what you are doing. Some of you will still give the same cream. You go today, you give whitening cream. The same recipe, the same ingredient, the same bubble to go. You give it to combination skin. You give it to sensitive skin. You give it to oily skin. They can't use the same cream. It's not possible. It does not work that way. They can't use the same cream. They can't use the same scrub. Someone like me, I can't use a um, rooty scrub. It will give me knuckles. It does not work for me. I've been using Yoko scrub ever since I found out that that scrub is lovely on me. It's good on me and I don't use it all the time because if you use salt all the time, as I said, it dries the skin. Okay, but if you have body, body, body spots, I think I already told you this, this scrub to use. Most of you don't know what you're doing. I just, I want to go into this business. And try and read. Most of you don't even make time to research. You don't do it. You just, eh, I make cream just to make money. No, don't do that. You try and make a lot of research. Research. Once you are into this kind of business, you need to read. Go wide. Research. No, no knowledge is a waste. And when you read, you learn more. So there's nothing like half a recipe or half. It works differently on skin. It works totally different. Just like the recipe I did on YouTube about dark spot when I first started YouTube. A lady said, ah, I've been using that product. She saw me in the market. Say, ah, Mickey, 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 see your face. Very fresh. Oh, I've been using that, your recipe. Your clean cap, your this thing on my face. Hey, it did not work for me, oh, Mickey. It did not work. And I told her, and I said, this is, that is what I use to take off my spots. And you said I even saw the after effect on YouTube. It's not that you are lying. I saw it. I said, hmm. It works. Screams work differently. All right. Just as much as I get irritated by lemon. Lemon juice, lemon oil. Some people don't get irritated by it. Some skin don't get any skin irritation by it. All right. And some people that we use hydroquinone. You need to see how bright their skin is. And even. I cannot use hydroquinone. Because it, I become dark. I become really dark so that's how the skin works all right try and make a lot of research if you're going into this our business try and research and try to go and learn some people will tell you i cannot pay to learn but you want to make cream for someone and you want to recommend products for someone then you must be out of your mind if you cannot pay to learn so you you might learn from quacks you might learn from some uh, yes i've learned from someone that all the recipe bobo tibora daadani but that doesn't, it won't stop me from learning. No, it won't stop me. Because in the end, you might, the one that you still say is rather, you might still take one or two things from it. Is it that a solid soap might be really good and your solid soap before that you were making wasn't nice? It's either our oils are top notch. And yes, ah, okay, this, the production of the oil is nice. I think I'll just stick to the oil. That is just how it works. All right. Don't ever stop learning. Only a fool stops learning. Don't ever stop and stop considering the money. Some of you will say, ah, it's too much. Huh? There was a lady that wanted to pay for my Vimeo video. The thing she wanted was not, it doesn't work that way when it comes to Vimeo because the videos are scattered. You see that you might have face cream here. You might have body cream. You know, it's scattered, organic, synthetic. It's just scattered. And she was like, hey, okay, I want glowing. I want this. I want, I was like, ah, mine doesn't work that way. Those things you want are in different videos. Like, ah, but that thing here I collected, I borrowed that money. Oh. I borrowed that money, Mickey. I borrowed it. You know what? You know what? Send my money back. Send my money back. Send my money back. And thank God I've not added that. I sent her money. Ah, thank you. God bless you, Mickey. I hope you are not angry. I say, why should I be angry? It's not your money. Ah, I'll use the 10,000 to go and start a business. I'll use it to go and do something. <laughs> anyway, this business does not work for everyone. That's just what I'm going to say. But there's something you should know. Hmm? Once you are using money to learn something, 
to acquire a skill or you are using it to um, enrich your brain you know? enlarge your coast with knowledge and stuff like that it is not a waste I don't count it as a waste. Some people say, hmm, Mickey is coming with learn, uh, selling skills. She wants to make sales. No, it is not a waste. Because you are doing it for yourself. No amount of money spent on yourself is a waste. Once you are not using it to buy clothes, now clothes have be waste. Because in the end, once you use money to buy immaterial things, you end up selling useful things in order to meet up. I would rather spend my money in learning rather than spend my money on trash. How many clothes I get? You know, if you be a lasher, but once it comes to learning, honey, I'm ready to go the extra mile to learn. You need to see the way I waste data on a normal basis. I'm always on YouTube. I surf the net. I go to other people's YouTube pages. I go to blogs. I read. You know, I read blogs. I read magazines. I go, I go to articles. You know, all this... Um, dermatological articles i read you need to try and enrich your brain no money is a waste too when it comes to having that knowledge it is not a waste the way she was sounding like as if in you know ah i have to use that ten thousand for business please i don't want to waste the money i don't want to waste the money <laughs> something learned with knowledge is not a waste i remember going for a class that i used almost 500k at first i start even me i started like that saying I just wasted that money for nothing. But with time, I noticed her soap was top notch. Her bath soap was really nice. You know, her oils was nice. The cream might not be on, on point, but the oil was good. The oil was really good. The soap was nice. You know, so I was like, ah, okay. Everything might not be perfect, but I got something out of it. Try and get that into your head. No knowledge is a waste. You're trying to enrich your brain. All right? And I will see you guys this week. This is a new week. Hopefully this week. And I love you guys like key. Love. Day. Bye guys. Mm. <laughs>